Hi everyone, hope you're all doing great. So uh, this is the third video of the installation series. We're going to talk about uh, installation of the cleanse match server and the resource kit. So everything is done like step one to step six is complete. Okay, so we'll be going to the step seven and eight, installing the cleanse match server in the resource kit. So let's uh, install the cleanse match server in the resource kit. So let's uh, go here. You need to go to this particular directory. Just see where is your uh, where is the software. Um, I have it here for Windows. So you need to install. We have already installed this server. Uh, we're going to install this cleanse. <clears throat> this one we're going to install. Run and parallelly let me open this one as well. This is a resource kit. It's not mandatory, but still this contains a lot of important things. So I need to do that. To install the resource kit, it's going to ask you something. So let me check. Uh, it's going to ask you this particular path of JBoss. So just uh, keep it handy. Yeah, this path. I'm talking about this path. So just uh, keep it handy. I'm running multiple things. It's quite slow. Just wait for some time then. If you face any issues or so regarding your installation process, you can always reach out to me. You can just send me a message. I'll just check it. This does take a lot of time actually to extract. I think this they have outsourced this whole logic to uh, Flexra. This is a big company. But I think uh, earlier it used to be pretty much faster. Now it's quite slow in most of the installation processes. So pretty much done. By the way, cleanse match server is nothing but the process server. So you need to install the process server. And what happens if you don't do it? If you don't do it, then you can't run any job. You can just create the base object, landing tables, match, merge, configurations. All those things you can do, but you can't run anything. Okay, so that's the reason why you need a process server. And um, process server uh, can be I mean you can scale it horizontally or vertically as well so you can do anything uh, let's say you can install one server in Germany another one in France another one in US another one in Canada and uh, you can have multiple class match servers and you can uh, you could use uh, your you can configure for configure your Informatica NDM to access all of those servers okay to to when uh, Informatica when you try to run a job then it's going to select that which is the best one and the load balancing everything is there right pretty much uh, the similar feature that you have in, in uh, most of the Informatica range of products like power center IDQ or ILM you have the same thing for most of the Informatic products okay so here we go just say okay so this is the resource kit. We'll install that later. First, uh, let's uh, install this cleanse match server. It's very simple actually. If you don't get any errors, then it's very, very simple. If you get any errors, then only uh, you have to do a lot of troubleshooting. Most of the errors are related to actually, I mean like uh, uh, Tomcat related er errors, Java related errors. You won't get much help from Informatica either. So pretty much you are on your own. Uh, that's the only uh, problematic thing in uh, installing this product. Otherwise, it's simple. Yeah. So just say next, next, next. Simple. Uh, you also need to have the license file. It'll ask you the license file. It's the pointed to the right location. That's it. Next, yeah, it's in my desktop. 
uh, there's no separate license file for the cleanse mail server. It's uh, the same thing. So the same license file. JBoss. I told you this path, right? You need to give the same path that we given in the server. Next, next, next. Uh, you can run this post into install script and parallelly I can also start this one. Resource kit is necessary, okay? Because a lot of sample scripts and in fact a lot of things will be there like uh, the Java, uh, the if you want to develop something related to C for user exits, so pretty much most of the things are there and you would need it. Uh, let me install this. So this won't take much time, just uh, 10 minutes or so then it will be done. Meanwhile we can go ahead. You don't need any license for this. So anyone can install this. Uh, I'm not going to go with a sample schema because I'll configure it in a separate step. Yeah, that's fine. Install. Next. Source only. Uh, don't uh, parallelly try to do it because that will hang your system but uh, if system is good then you can do it but avoid it. So basically three things in the uh, software side, uh, one is a hub server, one is a cleanse match servers and third one is not a server but it's just a resource kit but uh, three different bundles Informatica gives you for installation. The IDD everything comes as a part of the hub server. So no, no need to do any uh, separate installation for IDD. Uh, install, yeah. This will take some time and it will be done. Um, so it's installing the product you can see here. So I'll just uh, pause the video for some time and uh, we'll be back once this is done. Because there isn't any special step. Just you need to wait and see. That's it. It's uh, <clears throat> still taking some time I think so but there isn't any step here I mean once it is done you just say okay I mean that's it so once the installation is done just okay so I'll stop the thing now so pretty much this step is also done and if we go here then uh, we can see something like uh, this is also done okay so the only last step that is remaining is I will show you how to open the tool and you can configure the additional ORS okay so we'll do that in the fourth uh, part Okay, thanks. Uh, thank you very much. We, I'll conclude this third part. Thank you very much.